How does Tesla manufacture cars in just 90 minutes? Tesla is currently capable of producing up to 10,000 vehicles each week when at maximum capacity from only one factory. And it is planning to produce 20 million cars a year by 2030. The rate of production has grown exponentially over the past few years. This is due to the enormous demand and the increase of interest in electric cars. But how did the young company Tesla succeeded in ramping up its production in such little time? The production takes place at the Tesla Fremont factory in California. This famous facility opened as General Motors Fremont Assembly in 1962. Tesla took ownership in 2010. This rolled-up aluminium will soon turn into a fully functioning car in just 48 hours. The vehicle's shaping starts in the stamping center by unrolling the metal sheets and turning it into doors, trunks, hoods, and many other parts, using extremely precise machines. Using a conveyor belt, the parts are moved to the inspection stage. Workers inspect each part before sending them to storage in a vast warehouse. Now robots will start forming the car skeleton in the body shop by welding the parts together. 5,000 welds are required for Model 3, the first affordable car by Tesla. After the welding is completed by robots, the cars now move to the painting stage. Tesla Model 3 is meant to be manufactured on a mass scale, which will require more automation for the body production line. More than 1,000 robots are employed at the Model 3 body shop. They are set to improve accuracy while reducing the time spent. After painting, we come to the most challenging stage, the general assembly or as known as marriage, where all the main components of the vehicle, including the battery pack, are joined together. The production line is designed to be simple, where this empty body will turn into a fully functional car in just 43 steps in 90 minutes, on a line about 1,000 feet long. This puts the car generation of Tesla in line with the Germans, which is set to be the golden standard manufacturer. Tesla had previously struggled to build cars fast. Elon Musk described the entire assembly a few years ago as production hell. If you're going through hell, keep going. <laughs> Moreover, an additional assembly line was added under a massive tent in the factory's parking to push out more Model 3. This allowed more than 200,000 to exit the facility in 2019 alone. Tesla managed to pull through that difficult period by striking a better balance between the number of robots it uses and the number of human hands that help. Musk himself said you couldn't have people in the production line itself, otherwise, you drop to people speed. But he didn't cut all the staff from his factories, there are still jobs humans can do better than machines including looking after the machines themselves. Elon Musk first introduced autonomy in his factories on a large scale with the Model S production in 2017. But it was unsuccessful. When Model 3 was launched and the demand skyrocketed, it was time for the company to automate the process. Pulling the synthetic material over the foam of a chair, making it fit properly, stretching it out, and getting rid of the wrinkles, all was done by humans. Tesla was used to outsourcing the seats as most automakers do. But when a contractor had trouble building seats for the Model X, Tesla chose to move the whole operation in-house. Machines do have a big role to play as well, especially when the seats are ready for final assembly. Even here Tesla is focused on saving time. This tube feed bolts to the robots so they don't have to physically pick them up. An air gun shoots them through the vacuum tube as illustrated by Clean Technica, and shaves off about a second or so. Wheels and tires are then placed, and the car is then ready to be out. Tesla is now doing the same process in its factories in Berlin and Shanghai. Tesla is now shaping the new automotive industry for the upcoming years. This huge industry is not going to look the same anymore. Tesla the young company is capable to produce this enormous amount of cars due to the advanced technologies the world is having now. Tesla is leading the world in automotive autonomous technologies, and it's doing so in its production lines. Follow Mechanical Education for more updates in the automotive industry.